Costume and you could get the, uh, the shorts. Yeah. Oh, brisket sausage sandwich, sausage on a stick. Do I need a beaver, buddy? That sounds interesting. I love that tray. I've never seen anything like this, retail wise, in the whole of my life. Hi there, welcome back to a new vlog. Hi there. We are here to explore. Bucky's. Petrol station. Yes. <laughs> Sounds a bit old. We're really, really excited to be here, aren't we? Yes, yeah. We uh, first knew about Bucky's after watching um, Cara Nate. I don't know if any of you watched their, their vlogs. Um, they've travelled for years. Travel vloggers. Since the 2016, wasn't it? Something and like that. During lockdown, they then started, they're, they're, they're based in the US, and um, they then, due, due to COVID, had to travel in, in the US. And they did a video at Bucky's. They, they stayed. I was go on, say. so you say, yeah. <laughs> they spent 24 hours here. Yeah, and I think if I'm right, they only ever used to be in Texas. Bucky's. Bucky's was only ever in Texas. Previously. Previously. Yeah. And now they're starting to be, they're popping up at different places. And there is obviously one or. There's one in more? Daytona, which is. Yeah, where in Daytona, we are now. Florida. So, yeah, we are here yeah. now. So. It just happened to be on our route to go to. Um, we're travelling from Orlando to St. Augustine. It's on our route. It's like smack in the middle of the little trip. So we just thought, yes, let's go to Bucky's. We're really excited, aren't we? Yeah, uh, it's it's massive. It seems chaos. Complete chaos. There's no There's system. No order. Everyone's just driving everywhere. It's quite scary, it, isn't it, it? It kind of there's there's like two huge banks of, of petrol station, of petrol pumps. I think there would be a way that everyone drives in and then like go there, but uh, no, it's like anyone goes in whichever way and they want. Everyone's cutting each other up. There's beeps, and I have never seen so many massive RVs. I know, They're I know. Huge. No, it's really, really good. But no, but obviously that's one thing. But going in the store, the food, just everything in there, it's all. There's so much. You said the, the, the Bucky's brand is so popular, or well known, isn't it? Well, yeah. in the US. So we're just going to have a look. The food in here is supposed to be really good. And it's lunchtime. That's why we didn't want to eat much earlier on. If yes. you've been following along our vlogs, so if you follow on those, um, if you're new, welcome to the channel. And also please subscribe if you don't already. So we're going to explore. Let's go and see. Let's go and explore, eat, and see what there is. Yeah. This place is possibly the craziest place I have ever, ever been to. He's really cute, isn't he? Are you having a selfie with him? You can if you want. No. I'll let you be weird on your own. Where do we even start in this place? We're going to start with food, actually. Oh, AIDS sidetracked. What have you seen? Did I get a Bucky swimming costume? <laughs> oh my gosh, no. That, is that a cool bag? You love a cool bag. Oh, Aid, how much do you love a cool bag? Aid thinks it's a pet carrier. It is a cool bag. It is really quite cool. Isn't yeah, it? I thought it would be quite cool. I like the tube. Look. <laughs> Look, we need to get a river tube. We've got no water near us, but how cool would that be? Oh, no, I could get the swimming costume and you could get the, sh uh, the shorts. All right, we're hungry. There's burritos and tacos. Oh, look. Is that like a little sippy cup? It is as well. It's so cute. Is this the kind of thing you were fancying about? Ham, turkey, bacon, cheese, spicy mayonnaise, sun-dried tomato, pesto sauce. It's a club melt. Yeah. That beaver chips. Oh, brisket sandwich. Sausage on a stick. We've also got the bakery as well when we're ready for dessert. Those cinnamon rolls, $3.29, that's such a good price. Beaver tail. 
lemon bar. I think this is pretty much the same. I think I might go with a burrito. Plan. We've decided just to look around first. We've grabbed ourselves a basket. Aid's picked up pork rinds. I've got some pecan brittle. Um, so there's a few pork rinds. Um, so we're going to have a look at the trail mix. We've even got their own range of hot sauces. That's crazy. And their own spices as well. These look so cool. Brisket rub. $2.89, that's, or $2.98, that's a really good price, isn't it? Do their own barbecue sauce as well, plastic bottle too, which is quite handy, $2.99. I know that Aid's already wanting the mug, I bet he's wanting the hat as well. Hello, what have you seen? I've already seen these. <laughs> thought you'd want one. I thought you'd go for the red. Oh, I've seen salted caramel, honey butter, and cinnamon honey butter. Everywhere you look, there's something delicious. Looks so nice. Ooh. Do I need a beaver, buddy? That sounds interesting. There's so many different nuts. It's just spotted jalapeno, peanut brittle. He's grabbed that. Mm. The beaver what? nuggets. Aren't these what they had and they said are really good? They're peanut buttery, aren't they? Are they? Love all the look of the jarred stuff. It was this that caught my eye. The strawberry banana jam in proper mason jars as well. So much jerky to choose from. Found the pickles. We've got pickled quail eggs, pickled asparagus. We really want to, oh, pickled Brussels sprouts. I love the idea of trying that. Oh. What have you seen? Pickled jalapeno, oh, candied jalapenos. Oh, my favourite type of olives, feta cheese stuffed olives. Oh, look at that, that's so nice. I'm going to have a look around the home section now and then come back for food and eat in the car. Oh, these are nice. I like that, that coffee oh. sign. What have you seen? Oh, that's so sweet. We don't really use sugar or cream though. A bit of a waste on us. This is so pretty. What have you seen? Oh, it's our brand of um, oh, season cut. Ah, don't really need it though, do we? Twenty dollars. That's our actual thingy, isn't it? One, one. Yeah, no, it's not. It's just it's a. Not, it's not good Oh, that's, oh, I thought you said a bigger. I was going to say it's the same size. Yeah. Yeah, that's ours. Oh, that's so cool. I love everything so much. This is for artichoke dip, but it's actually got the ingredients <laughs> and, and the spread. I love artichoke dip. I know, it's all so nice. Really nice. Oh look, that's our kind of food. Cheese, mayonnaise, pimento peppers, onion, garlic and salt and pepper. Everything is so, so nice all the signs as well for your home. AIDS after a t-shirt. That sweatshirt. Sweatshirt. Yeah. A bit plasticky, that's, isn't that's it? That's right, actually. Is it? Oh, no. It's like hidden buckies. Isn't that cosy? I love that tray. That is so cool. Oh, look. This, oh, you wet them. They're cloths. Okay. That's cool, isn't it? You got it. Oh, yes. Are we getting out? It's a bit crazy in here. Smokers are huge. There's the massive petrol station. I've never seen anything like this, retail-wise, in the whole of my life. Right, should we eat lunch and then talk yes. about our experience? Right, go do share the mines. I need some napkins of mine. It's going to be some. messy. I've got some. Thank you. I've gone for a Texas cheese steak burrito. I've got the sliced brisket sandwich. Um, we were recommended to go with the burrito. We were chatting to a local lady in there. She brought her daughter in for her first visit. Ooh, look at that. And they were just as overwhelmed as we were. All my foil is stuck to my burrito. Oh, this is really wet and gooey. I've never eaten a burrito before. It smells yeah. nice. My brisket looks beefy. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that beef.
leaf. Mm. This is so delicious. Mm. Try it. Okay, only if you try mine. Okay, but you try that first. Mmm, that's so soft. Mmm, that's tasty. Mmm. That brisket is nice. So I've got beef, peppers, chili, jalapeno, mayo, onions. It's so delicious. And everything's made there. Chopping they, up the beef. The great big piece of, I don't know what you call it, but brisket, I guess, was out and started slicing it and cutting it, chopping it. All done there. Mm. Um, this was 9.98, my burrito. Mine and was 8.40 something, I think. Mm. I went for the sliced brisket. They also do a chopped, and they do, I think, the full pork um, as well. That looks nice. Mm, good. Mm, good, not good. So good. I'm not meat in it though, no. Mm. <laughs> so, honest opinion of Bucky's in our experience today? Mm. Yeah, it's okay. I don't think I'd rush back. I think it's just so busy. Yeah, it was busy. I mean, and the food again, um, we were chatting about this beforehand, wasn't it? And we I love barbecue food. Um, I'm not a huge fan of, like, say, pulled pork. It's the, the really sweet. I love barbecue stuff, mm. but um, the brisket was nice. It's just a bit too, like, samey kind of thing, so. I really liked mine, but I don't think I'd order it again. Mm. It was just, I don't know, I just felt completely overwhelmed in there. I felt like I was under everyone's feet. Everywhere you walked, you're in the way of someone. Um, yeah, it was a bit... I think they've got something right in there because people are there definitely for the brand because part of the store was a lovely yes. homeware section. It and you, empty. You recorded, and it was empty. Because I actually said to you, there's no one here, but everyone was all looking at all the Bucky's merch and everything else, the food. Um, there were orders continuously coming out and people choosing things. And uh, the chaos is outside. Everyone's just driving everywhere in different directions, cutting everyone up, and it's just the same in the store. If it was quieter, it might have been a different experience. Um, yeah, and I think that there's some things in there that looked, oh yeah, like that kind of thing. I'd heard mm. about the... Um, oh yeah, you bought oh, some bits and pieces, actually. Yeah, we did, actually. So, let me just... Is it this one? Yeah. Should we do a Bucky's haul? Yeah. So, we bought some original pork rinds. Um, I think they were one dollar something, so... Yeah, I think it was one forty-nine. Um, we've also bought some uh, pecan brittle. That looks nice. That was three dollars nineteen. And also... Ah. Oh, jalapeno. <laughs> that was two dollars something. So, and we $2. bought a cake as well. I'm not going to get it out, but it's a pecan cake. Pecan, like it's slice. It's like a slice it's with caramel. similar to what we had. Didn't we have a pecan slice the other day? Oh, that's nice. My, Pecan pie from up in oh, Manchester. Yeah. Three sixty-nine. And I got myself. This is Lisa's favourite purchase. Nine ninety-eight. You tried to get a T-shirt, but they were either large or triple XL, and I'm not that big. Not yet. Oi. But that's our Bucky's haul, and with that, we're going to make our way to Saint Augustine. I wouldn't rush back. I think it's just too busy for my liking. Me personally, it's manic and I don't do manic. It's I came out of there feeling quite stressed and my heart palpitating and things. There's lots of kind of great stuff in there and it's the kind of thing mm. you could probably get a gift for someone if they've heard of it yeah, it's and fun. things like that. I think they've definitely got the brand on point with it and I think that's is the main reason was the main reason why we came. Yeah, that's true. Um, I'd go back to try and get you that t-shirt because I know you really wanted that. Yeah, there was a hoodie as well. I liked it, but it was just a plain grey hoodie with the plastic transfer on the front of it. Wow, look at that. Um, whereas the t-shirt was oh yeah, the t-shirt was just just it was quite sweet. Quite nice actually. Yeah. The t was, prices in there were reasonable, weren't they yeah, as well? Not so bad. But, but let us know if you've been and are you intrigued to go and go and find Kara and Nate. Cara with a K and look for their 24 hours in Bucky. It was, Bucky's, quite, yeah. it was quiet when they went, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. And I think the, the sweet selection looks really good. Like they make all their own food and everything. Yeah, like the large cookies are only 99 cents, mm. which is, is really quite good. And, all their and potato chips are like 149 a bag. Yeah, and they're fam famous for their jerky as well, mm. I think. So we didn't get any. 
Um, some of that was quite pricey. I've just kind of contributed like myself because a bag was yeah. That? So some stuff in there, like obviously the the, the crispy bits and the trail mix and that, isn't too bad mm. price, is it? So, but no, we better make a move. Hope you've enjoyed this, and we're going to crack on with the rest of our blogging and head to Central Casting. Yes. Thank you for watching. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Just feel so lucky.